Three, two, one, start. Hey guys, I'm Roman. <laughs> I'm Lou. <Luke>. Shit. <laughs> I didn't think you were going to actually start. do it. <laughs> and welcome back to the Bourbon Beats, where today we have another exciting episode for you guys. What do we got, Lou? All right, today we got the Rebel Alliance, mm. kind of, or the Rebels mm. against each other. Yeah, so we got two Ooh. store picks today of Rebel. Yes, we have the El Cerrito store pick coming in at 60% or 60% uh, percent alcohol mm. by volume, 120 <laughs> proof. Yeah. And uh, the other one is, I forgot. And this is the Broken Pallets uh, pick. Uh, we got this from Santee Market and Liquor. This one is coming in at 126 proof. Yes, 63% mm. alcohol mm. by volume for those of you who don't know. <laughs> So uh, this is pretty exciting because I do like Rebel Bourbon. I mm -hmm. don't think I've had a store pick one though, so this is going to be no, pretty you drank exciting. This one, did I? Mm -hmm. Oh, there it was a quite a while back. Must but, have been yeah. a heavy drinking day. <laughs> <Yes>. <laughs> That's all we have. That's all we have around here, except for right now. Because yeah. again, guys, I can't drink. I just had surgery, so I have to mostly spit it out and then have a little teaspoon sip. But before we begin, please, guys, Lou, what do we say? We like and subscribe. We like and subscribe, or please like and subscribe. Please like and subscribe. <laughs> yeah, one job. We do too. You had one job. <laughs> please like and subscribe, guys. We do appreciate your guys' comments and views. Uh, we want to know how we're doing. So please, again, let us know. So uh, which side do you want yeah. to start on? Uh, we can go with the El Cerrito. So. Um, mm -hmm. Just a quick thing, um, I n knew more about the El Cerrito pick when it first came out, but I forgot since then. I tried to look it up real quick and I couldn't find much about it. So we're going on a very little information for the actual, you know, yeah. more detailed We're rebels. Yeah. <laughs> um, but this one, we have it on hand. This is straight from the barrel. Um, the mash bill is 68 corn, 20 wheat, and 12 uh, barley. Um, this one, let me see this is on there. Yeah, I don't say it. No. Nope. Nope, not at all. It. We're oh. rebels. <laughs> all right, so we want to do El Cerrito then first, right? Yeah. Okay, That's so fine. here we go. Mm -hmm. On the nose. It smells young. I'll tell you that right now. Isn't that like cherries? Definitely cherries, though. What's that cherry they use for uh, old fashions? Uh, like Sardos? Yes, that's what I'm getting right there. That there's leather, yeah. Ah, plain sugar, not brown sugar. You know, like a plain sugar smell. Mm -hmm. Some honey mm -hmm. to it. A little bit of cinnamon. Can Light on the baking kinda spices. Kinda pick out a little bit of vanilla. Yeah. Or I'm getting it mixed up with the sugar. Yeah, it's mixing up with that plain, plain sugar, like powdered sugar. Yeah. All right, well, let's, let's do it. Hmm. Mm. Oh. Ooh. Palette. I take, I take back everything I said. <laughs> I take back everything. That is dang delicious. I was so scared when I saw. I know. I was, I'm like, I was just mm. like, yeah. The smell is average. The taste, barely average. The taste mm -hmm. is fantastic, yeah. but that is the first sip. Mm hmm. That is the first Every sip. time we have a second sip, it reveals a little bit more of its Victoria's secrets. <laughs> and then it's disappointing sometimes. So Because she's a rebel. <laughs> I'm ready to go for it again. Finish it off. Give it a score. Mm -hmm. Go to the next. So, here we go. Yeah, the nose. Again. Yeah, the nose is... It's coming out more because we've you know had a sip. Getting a little bit of more of an ethanol kick to it. Ready? I'm ready. Yeah, let's do it. All right. Mm. There's that ethanol I was looking for. I get a little bit of some sort of like candy bar thing. You get like a hint of like chemical -y? Yeah. That, 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 I, couldn't, I couldn't figure out how to explain it. Hmm. <laughs> it's back down to earth again. That's, but not bad. Not, not bad. bad. Yeah, not bad. It's not good. Bad. No, I it's mean, good. the flavor is good. good. The, the, yeah, like that you said, first it has, sip though just really threw me off. It was really good for some reason. Um, I can't pinpoint something we can it, compare it with, like describe it. Like you ever taste, <clears throat> like it, it, like say you, you ate barbecue and it was wrapped in aluminum foil and some foil was left in it accidentally. Oh, oh, you know, that's, it's not that's, quite that's, that's painful. exactly that, you know. But like you get this like weird. I was gonna go with like an like a like an Altoid. 
you first chew on it like that that like cold yeah, front gives you some kind of, i don't know if it's not always not the thing, taste yeah but... it's like a very medicinally aftertaste I mean, it, yeah. which is kind of weird because it kind of the aftertaste like, like yeah uh, it kind of compliments it. That's it's a really it's, weird feeling. It's, it's like a rebel. It's it's it's, it's with it and it's fighting it at the same time. Wow. It's, like, it's like hug and Daddy chill. <laughs> Brought to you by Coke Zero. Coke Zero. Gotta clear my palate out a little bit on that one, but I'm gonna go ahead and give that a five. Five point three. It's good. Yeah. It's good. That's not bad. I'll give it a five. Five, five, a five. is good. Six is very good. Five is good. So mm -hmm. I'll give it a five. Yeah. Five, five is good. Two and five, five and a half. Okay. Something like that. Next one. All right. Let's check this one out. Now, this is the one I've been looking forward to. Yeah. So this is the Broken Palettes Whiskey Club on this one. And on the nose, what do I get? I'm going to let you figure that out. Yeah. You find anything in that? Like a dark cherry, like it's not like it's, it's it's not a strong smell, but it's like it's, it's that chocolate covered cherry, like yeah. that. You know, it's very I, I smell it. Like you know, those like chocolates. holiday, yeah, uh, those holiday chocolate candies. cherry. What are those things? Those little. No, I know what you mean. It has like alcohol inside of them. Yeah, kind it of. has that. That's uh, exactly what that I smell. Candy like white milky stuff in there. Mm -hmm. White milky stuff. <laughs> are you familiar with white milky stuff? <laughs> yeah, boy. <laughs> Back to the nose. Back to the nose. Back to the nose. <laughs> yeah, that, that's really all I'm getting is just like this chocolate covered cherry, man. Um, like a you uh, mean? oaky vanilla toast type thing. I uh, dude, you have to really get your nose in. Yeah, there. I, you have to that's really why, yeah. get your nose in there. Now, yeah, now it's about like. Yeah, brown sugar. French toast with like some kind of like vanilla custard syrup okay, some custard thing in going on. All right. It's okay. Let's do it. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Definitely thicker. Uh, that depth of flavor. There's a lot of flavors, dude. Yeah, there's a lot packs, of flavors. Some good yumminess in there. The problem is trying to differentiate it. It was like just a whole like mess of flavors, and they all tasted delicious. But now I'm trying to like figure out what's what. But I will say this: that chocolate covered cherry, mm -hmm. I am tasting it. Oh, yeah, I'm 100% yeah. tasting yeah. that, which is fantastic. I smell the hint of it in there, but mm. the t yeah, you can no, definitely. No, it's in. It's in. It's still there. It's not going away. The heat is still there. And it's not like an overpowering heat. It's a very, very minimalist heat. But it's complementing that chocolate covered cherry that I'm getting. That's really good. Yeah, because you know like when you when you eat the chocolate covered cherries yeah. and then after you swallow and everything and that residual flavor left over. Yeah, that that's that's what I'm getting. Yeah. It's it's, it's like definitely a, there. It's like a chocolate. It's kinda weird. It's like a, it's like a dark chocolate. Mm hmm That's that is very So this is straight from the barrel. Uh, so these are weeders. Um and supposedly, um, really this is the same mash bill as the Larceny Barrel Proof. Really? Mm -hmm. Oh, I do love Larceny. I do love Larceny. So maybe that's where I'm getting that's it. Near your shelf right there. That, we're not touching that one. That's too much of a high proof and I can't even drink it anyway. So you want to drink it? Mm -hmm. You would. What do you want? Uh, I have the B and the C. What's the open right there? The C. Okay. The C it is. Yeah, you would. You would take my beautiful C. <laughs> ah. So I'm going to go in while he's doing this. I'm going to finish this off with my teaspoon sip here to get a proper, proper rating on that. Because it's, 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 again, guys, it's, uh, it's really hard to just not be able to drink it because you kind of need, you know, all aspects of a, of a bourbon tasting. So I'm going to go ahead and have my teaspoon sip to finally get like a proper review out of that. So. Yeah, so this is 126.4 proof uh, batch C923 Larceny barrel proof. This 126, and this is 126 even. Oh, so it's so good. It's so good. Now I got that heat. <laughs> Remember, it's only it's only a little bit. Um, dude, this is a this is fire, dude. I'm giving this a seven. That is so good. 
I believe a seven is great. Yes, a seven is great. That is fantastic. Broken Palettes Whiskey Club uh, from Santee Marketing Liquor down in San Diego or El Cajon more specifically, I believe, right? Yeah. Get that. If you can get it, get it. Um, <clears throat> I don't recommend oh, yeah. getting a store pick. Wait, which one? The C9 or the... Uh, going back to that... No, the, store pick, the right? Rebel. Yeah, it's fantastic. Like, we love Larceny, too. We, oh, yeah. We haven't touched on this for a little while because we had so many other things Last to, week. to play with. <laughs> No, guys, I'm giving that a seven. That is great. But is yeah, I just, had, I just had the Larceny, and it, it tastes great. And then I had the Rebel, and it was just the, the robust flavor that came Dude, out that of it. chocolate-covered cherry yeah, is now it, phenomenal. now it's coming out. It's delicious. Yeah, it is great. Man, y'all did. You, mm. Broken palates. You done did good. Mm. More did straight good. from the barrel, please. Yes, I will uh, definitely pick this up. If you, if you guys happen to be living in El Cajon, Again, Santee Marketing Liquor, that is fantastic. That is another loss for El Cerrito. <laughs> hey, it is what it is. We're you know? being honest. Yeah. We're being honest. We're not honest. picking sides or anything. You know, we, we, we might have our favorite places to go to, mm -hmm. but when it comes I down like El Cerrito, to, yeah, you know? to giving, you know, a fair assessment of what, we, you know, we like better, mm -hmm. fair is fair. Fair is fair. What do you give it? Great? Seven? Seven point five? I think I give it a seven point five. I think I know you. Don't jump to eight. Seven point seven. Okay, perfect. I'm That's okay good. with that. that I wanted fantastic. to go a little bit higher, and we, we might revisit this and do it by itself. Yeah, and, and it's hard to do double I, reviews of the same thing. Yeah. I don't. I don't know if people like you guys like, like yourselves want to see another review mm -hmm. of the same thing. But uh, you know, mm -hmm. that's something that I feel like it's going to grow into in its own, and it's going to definitely, definitely yeah. improve. I think this like will be one of my top weeders sitting around you know to i mean drink. we're barely that's in january good. Yeah. and this is this is already a top mm -hmm. top 10 so far yeah again we're in january for, 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 for what we have in january <laughs> which is not that much so far <laughs> this is definitely topping up there all right guys I'm, my name is roman <laughs> i'm lou thanks for joining us please like and subscribe peace out guys. all right see y'all later <laughs>